about two months ago, the museum contacted me and asked if we'd help recover a fossil. And I thought, well, that sounds pretty cool. I've never done that before. Um, so we immediately jumped on it. And for the last two months, we've been meeting and planning and making site visits. And we actually, uh, one of our team members made the cart that we wheeled it out on. Uh, so we've been preparing for this for quite a while. We we're extracting a fossil from a baleen whale. And the interesting thing is that this is actually fossil baleen, not just bone. Uh, baleen is a soft tissue and rarely fossilizes. We probably have three or four examples in our museum right now. So this is going to be part of a very, very small collection. I wanted to be an archaeologist. So I used to hike the canyons around here looking for whatever, whatever I could find, an arrowhead or bone, whatever. So uh, one summer day I was walking and I noticed a what I thought was part of a bone sticking out of this rock. So I called my friends and we <laughs> moved it on logs, four or five logs. We rolled it up near the edge of the ravine and we put it on my folks' property. So it's been sitting there ever since then. So I called Hal, sent him some pictures. He says, oh, I want to see it. So he comes out, he looks at it, he goes, oh my God, that's fossilized baleen on the side of there. He said there's, only, there's less than 20 examples of fossilized baleen in the world. 